she's back and she's feeling good. She's having a big drink. How was it? Now she gets to do schoolwork. Yeah, finally. Like, what a horrible thing that she has hardly been doing schoolwork, huh? Yesterday, you just Your did best reading. Thing. Sylvie's so out of it. She's like, you just did reading while I was sick. No, nope, Gabby's been doing full school. I did school. She did school. No, like when you Just wait, we forgot to say good morning. Oh, good morning. Good morning. Hope you have a hope today is a fabulous day. Do look at like Sophia it? looks so different. Doesn't she look different? Can you guys tell? How do you feel different? No, her lips are a little bit peeling off. But I feel lighter. You feel lighter? <laughs> Even your face looks lighter. Yeah, that's what happens when you don't eat for two days. If I didn't eat for two days, nothing bad would nothing would happen. It's it's crazy she that she didn't eat for two days and she looks so different. She woke up this morning and she, the very first thing she said was, "Give me pizza." Oh, good morning. <laughs> oh, good morning, and then give me pizza because we had pizza the other day yeah, and she pizza. didn't have any. Mine's in, the, mine's in the oven. Yeah, hers is in the oven. Say good morning. What do you guys think? Do you want to jump today? We haven't jumped the dogs in a long time. You want to jump? Today? I jumped Macy when Sophia was sick. Yeah, you're always jumping. Do you want to jump the dogs today though? You want to try and jump the bunnies again? No. No. I keep wanting to video this and I keep forgetting, but at night when I go and kiss Gabby goodnight, I I bend down and I go to kiss Gabby and out of nowhere, Macy will run. She'll fly to us and she'll stand on both legs and jump up and kiss me on the lips and then go back to wherever <laughs> she was. And if she doesn't do that, I say, give me a kiss to Gabby. And Macy is like, whoa, a kiss. <laughs> she comes, but she, it's a thing. Every single night, she has to kiss me goodnight, doesn't she? Let's see if she'll do it. Macy. 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 Give me a kiss. Yeah, but it's way cuter at night because I all, most of the time I just have to put my head down to act like I'm gonna kiss Gabby and she's like, boom, and she kisses me. She yeah. always gets me first. Do you are her second Watch. mama. I am her second mama. Macy, give me a kiss. Yeah, Thank she's a you. kissing dog. Cookie's over there like, wait, what's happening? Is she getting something that I'm not getting? Ew. And Toby doesn't really kiss. Well, kiss. For any of you guys wondering when Gabby's um, very first Schleich movie is coming out, it should be out this weekend. I've been working on it. We've been working on yes. it. It's a lot of You've work. You've been working on it. Yeah, Gabby shot the whole thing herself, wrote the script herself. Yeah. Let's go into the bunny room. Let's and go. And Shy's in there again. Yeah, look at our messy bunny pen. I'm I swear he comes in, hangs out, and then jumps into the girl. Yeah, he doesn't just like go hop. Hop, hop. He goes, hop, <clears throat> let's look around, poop everywhere, and then go see my girl. We've resigned ourselves to the fact that they want to be together and we want them to be together. The actual only reason we're keeping them apart at this point is because I worry about the babies. But I don't want them to be depressed or sad. I want them to be happy and I want them to be together. And she's going to be pregnant anyway because we couldn't get into the vet sooner. So, here. There's not much we can do about it. We booked. We booked them. Yeah. Whoops. We booked it. All right. I know what you want to be there. I need to clean this pet in today. Oh my gosh, you guys. This one's the widest. Have you? They're a week old today. Oh, they're hopping. Do you know why they're hopping? Ow! Jeez Louise. <laughs> they bit you? They, they bite. Oh my god. They don't have teeth yet. So oh, they well, they got something in there. I got mine. So, I which? I this one. Okay, so I think. Can see? <laughs> put them all down beside each other. I want this one. I'm getting this. I think that one. Oh said. no, this one's sore. Oh no. <laughs> that one keeps on. I falling. don't know what that's about. Oh look. Oh my god, mom, look at mine. Oh my gosh. <laughs> you guys. Like, okay, put like... them on the bed here so we can show everybody. This guy's mine. Oh, look at it. Oh, okay. you have to tell them that Mom, we're going to be them. All right, so I don't know why this guy that is one sore. That be yours. Yeah, I get the defective one. Gabby said this guy could be mine. Mom, I love this guy. Yeah, he was so cute. <laughs> Sophia has eaten an entire piece of pizza today, and she is hungry again. It's lunchtime now, and she's super hungry. So that's amazing because she hasn't eaten really in two days. 
She's so hyper. The food feels good, huh? It feels good to eat, doesn't it? Gives you energy. I am making pizza for Sophia. She had pizza for breakfast and now she's having pizza for lunch. Maybe not the healthiest thing, but when you haven't been able to eat for a couple of days that you just want what you want. Anyways, so the trouble with my lesson and with going over trot poles, the girls can do it, anybody can do it. I can't do it, she always stops. And I thought it was because she wasn't respecting me, but um, a shy Sonata, you, some of you guys follow her on Instagram. She sent me this message and she said, Post should always involve your legs, but you can absolutely squeeze a little extra while posting to encourage them forward. You always want leg on over poles. It keeps the momentum going so they don't break to a walk and so they pick up their feet instead of dragging them over the poles or tripping on them. I had no idea. What I've always been doing is I get to the poles, like I'm going up a hill, and then I let go of my legs because I feel like it's like going down a hill, she's just gonna go over them. So that's what I've been doing wrong. It's just crazy to me how sometimes you have to hear something a million different ways, and then suddenly it just clicks. So I'm so happy that she sent me that message because I think I got it now. I think I totally get it. The problem with that though is that I can picture it in my mind and I can imagine it, and then when I get there, I'm like, wait, what? What What do I have to do? It's always so much more confusing to actually doing it than to read about it, but um, I think it's gonna make a big difference. library and exchanged our books Daddy. now we're headed to the store usually Sam picks us up at the library but he went to get his hair cut so we decided we were gonna go to the store and get something yummy for supper what I actually went like how you put on skates and go to the skating rink Hi guys, I'm home and I just realized that part of my tree fell down. It's fallen down. I just realized it, but I guess apparently Laura knew about it a couple days ago. I remember uh, we had a big windstorm when it was sunny and raining the other day and wind must have knocked it down. Weird. So now we got like a little mini fort here. Good for now, freezing out.
about six horses in the last week. Six horses. And guess how many people got back to me? One. One. Literally one person. So I'm thinking that what's happening is that a lot of the ads that I'm responding to are old ads and they just haven't been taken down because the horse has been sold or is not available anymore. So we still have one horse that we're going to see on a Saturday, that really tall guy. <clears throat> I'm fine with him because like, I can handle Ben. I could ride Ben. It's I could ride Ben. A lot of people are not happy about us trying that horse, but you never know. It might work out for us. And um, it seems like everybody on uh, YouTube does not want us to get that horse. Everybody on Facebook thinks it's a perfect horse. And everybody on Instagram is divided. Half of them think it's a good horse and half of them think it's not a good horse for us. Sophie's jumping. She's back, you guys. Feeling good. So a lot of people have been sending me this one horse. A lot of people. His name is Sam. Sam is a 16 hand 10 year old off the track thoroughbred he has done some hunter in the past but is currently being used as a dressage horse to teach adult amateur ladies um he is quiet and steady under saddle and is not spooky he is well liked by the ladies that ride him but he hasn't cantered um much because the ladies are too nervous to canter him he does really like to jump but hasn't jumped in the two years that i have owned him as we use him for a basic dressage only and haven't really hacked him since i owned him either so i don't know how he hacks out in addition, this is the part where it kind of gets tricky for me. In addition, he does have a cataract in his left eye, but his eye is in good, stable shape and he can still see. He is best suited for someone who just wants to have a bit of fun with a horse. Offers will be accepted. Here's the link to the video. Okay, so basically I'm going to show you his picture. So this is Sam. I don't know. Maybe yeah. not, because like of the eye thing and the bit of fun thing. Yeah. Like I want to do like shows and lessons. Yeah, we want to do shows and stuff. And um, mostly mom wants me to do shows. Mostly mom wants her to do shows. But what? But you guys, that's the thing that we have not talked about yet. The girls are getting ready for their ver very first show. They're getting ready for really? their first actual show. Uh, but we don't what know anything about doing? it. We don't know what they have to wear. We don't know what we have to buy. We don't know what we don't know anything. We're going to apparently be getting a newsletter soon and telling us everything that we need. And yeah, so it's a bit nerve wracking, but we're excited. Are you excited? Are you excited? Yeah. Are you excited? Whoops, are you excited to show? Yeah, just to let you know I'm doing flat class. You're doing flat shows? Yeah, but I might do jumping too. At what? I might do jumping too. But you don't know how to jump yet. That's why I said flat class for now. Oh, okay, for now, I get ya. For a second there, I thought you wanted, we're gonna just go to the show and start jumping. I'm doing lock drop. I'd there. probably fall off. <laughs> you would probably fall off. Hey guys. Me too. All right, Gabby, what are you, are you jumping at this, at your first show? No. No, but you'll be with your friends too. So it'll be a lot of fun and you'll probably be obsessed with it. I'm probably gonna be the only one in my, um, only one at my barn doing a walk talk here. If you have any tips, then leave them in the comment below. I did ask around about cataracts and most people said it's not a big issue as long as it's super mild and it's not causing any problems. So I don't think the, the cataract probably isn't that big of an issue. But let me know what you guys think about Sam. So this is going to be a huge update video. Basically, uh, we inquired about the farm that we went to see because even though it needs a lot of work, um, which we're prepared for, um, we uh, emailed about it and we literally just got a response today and the guy said he has a million people interested in it because it's such a good price. So we're like at the bottom of the list and he'll keep us updated um, when we can come and see it. So, so we hopefully we'll be able to go and see that soon. Hopefully it doesn't get sold out from under us. I've been working on Gabby's video. It's almost done, you guys. It should be up really soon. And Sophie should have a video up on her on her channel really soon. Can't wait for you guys to see what it's about. It's something super cool. Um, anyway, comment of the day. Nary Shadow. Nary Shadow says, Hi guys, it's my birthday today. Could I have a shout out? Love you guys. Keep the good keep up the good work. And so yeah, we wanted to say Happy, Happy birthday. birthday! Air Moo Shipper. Sorry, I'm really terrible at names. <laughs> said no you don't need to be the boss you need to be a team and what she means by a boss most people use boss 
um, as and leader uh, interchangeably. Leader of the team. Yeah, leader like, of the team. So we don't want to be the boss of her, but we want to be the leader of her. We and, and we know from experience that Sabrina is the kind of horse that needs a leader. She's a, not at the top of the herd, and as she feels more comfortable when she has a, an <coughs> obvious leader. Um, she Fiona is the leader of her, no problem, and she uh, loves Fiona. She uh, is Fiona's shadow at the barn. Um, so whenever we say boss, we mean leader. Okay, this is another hard one. Christina Mertovit. Christina Mertovit? Um, you're brave, Laura. My mom is scared of horses. You just need to ride often until you feel comfortable Christina in this. Christina Mertovit? Until you feel comfortable in the saddle. Maybe try lunging Sabrina over the pole so you can focus more on keeping her forward. That helped me a lot. So I definitely have some things to try to get her going over the poles. I think they're going to work. But thank you so much for your comments, for all of your comments. Um, don't forget, I was afraid of horses too until just this past summer when I all of a sudden got obsessed with Ziggy. And then um, here I am uh, six months later. Anyway, that is it for today. Tomorrow we are at the barn. The girls are going to ride. Both of the girls are going to ride tomorrow. And on Saturday we are going to go and see an amazing horse. And... Um, on Sunday, we have another barn day plan, and it is going to be a super fun We're filming one. videos from my channel, Kaylee and me. Yeah, with, with her friends. It's going to yeah. be super cool. Anyway, that is it for today. And Wait, we is that the potluck on this Yeah, we're having a potluck. Yeah, we're having a potluck on Sunday, Yeah, and we're videotaping The kids videos. planned it. The kids planned it. It's yeah. just crazy. <laughs> <laughs> They're getting so old. Anyway, that is it for today. We'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to make sure to hit that subscribe button down below.